Good morning, students. So, in the previous class, we discussed about uh, numerical differentiation and the numerical integration. So, now uh, uh, I think maybe uh, uh, from this class to at least four to five to four class, uh, we will discuss uh, solving differential equations solving differential equations using numerical methods and then solving partial differential equations by numerical methods so these are the remaining two sections uh, in the third unit i think probably i will finish it uh, the middle of next week otherwise at least the end of the next week okay so the first method to solve the differential equation is the Taylor series method. So we studied the Taylor series uh, in semester three in the analytic functions. Okay. Now using Taylor series method, we are going to solve the differential equation. Okay. So consider the one-dimensional initial value problem dy by dx is equal to y dash is equal to a function of x comma y where uh, y of x naught equal to y naught where f is a function of two variables x and y and uh, the point x naught x naught and the y naught x naught comma y naught is a known point is a known point on the solution curve so purpose of Taylor series so is uh, Taylor series uh, is an idea used in computer science, calculus, chemistry, physics, and other kinds of higher level mathematics. So Taylor series is used to create an estimate of what your functions look like. Taylor series, uh, Taylor's polynomial is an essential concept in understanding numerical methods. Taylor series is a single step method and works well as long as the successive derivative can be calculated easily. So A, to find the numerical solution of the uh, first order differential equation, even you can solve the second order differential equation, simultaneous differential equation. So that is not in our syllabus. So first order differential equation, solving first order differential equation using uh, numerical methods. Okay. So to find the numerical solution of the equation dy by dx is equal to function of x comma y uh, given the initial condition y of x naught equal to y naught. So Taylor series formula. So this is the Taylor series formula y n plus 1 equal to y n uh, plus h by 1 factorial into y n dash that is a derivative of y n plus h square by 2 factorial into y n double dash. Uh, plus h cube by 3 factorial into o n triple dash plus and so on. So here it is given what is the uh, o n power uh, rth derivative. So dr power y by dx at uh, at the point x and comma o n. At the point x and comma o n. So this is the first problem. Solve dy by dx is equal to x plus y uh, given y of 1 equal to 0 e of 1 equal to 0 and uh, we need to find we need to find the y of 1.1 and the y of 1.2 by Taylor series method so what is given the question so dy by dx is equal to x plus y is given the question so you can write uh, dy by dx is equal to y dash so y dash equal to x plus y. And uh, one more thing, the initial condition is given, that is y of 1 equal to 0, that is given. So this implies uh, x naught equal to 1 and y naught equal to 0. So this is x naught. This is x naught. Uh, uh, so actually this is x naught. Okay, x naught, this is y naught. Okay. So x naught equal to 1 x not equal to 1 and y not equal to 0 and h value h value is uh, 0 0.1 because x not is 1 and uh, x1 is what x1 is 1.1 1 
x2 is 1.2 okay so h is 0.1 okay so now what is given the question y dash is equal to x plus y now from this find y double dash y double dash is equal to uh, you should differentiate with respect to x so 1 plus y dash so if you differentiate again y triple dash is equal to 0 plus y double dash so if you differentiate again y fourth dash is equal to y triple dash so i think you know how it behaves hereafter okay now correspondingly you should find okay correspondingly you need to find y not dash y not dash is equal to uh, x not plus y not x not plus y not what is x not x not is 1 y not is 0 so 1 so y not dash is equal to 1 similarly for y double dash is equal to 1 plus y dash you need to find y not double dash y not double dash is equal to 1 plus y not dash so 1 plus y not dash is 1 so 2 so y not double dash is 2 similarly for y y not triple dash is equal to y not double dash y not double dash is equal to 2 from the previous uh, value so y not fourth derivative equal to y not third derivative that is 2 okay now you should uh, write the Taylor series uh, formula say so Taylor series by Taylor series y1 equal to y1 equal to here it is given y n plus 1 so if you substitute n equal to 0 you will get y1 so y1 equal to we substitute n equal to 0 in the formula we will get uh, y1 equal to y0 plus h by 1 factorial into y0 uh, dash plus h square by 2 factorial y0 double dash and so on so you need only a h you need h value you need h value and you need what why not why not dash why not double dash why not triple dash and so on so you know that uh, h is equal to 0 0.1 <coughs> and why not why not dash why not uh, double dash values are here why not is 0 why not dash is 1 why not double dash is 2 why not uh, triple dash is 2 why not fourth derivative is 2 so now if we substitute in the formula and uh, you need to see calculator you should simplify and get the answer so this is uh, y1 equal to y of uh, x1 x1 is uh, 1.1 is equal to 0 0.1103833 so next uh, take x1 equal to 1.1 take x1 equal to 1.1 and uh, y1 is uh, this value you know that and the h is 0 0.1 now i am going to find y2 y2 is uh, y of x2 y of uh, x2 is what y of 1.2 so again same procedure okay y dash is equal to uh, x plus y that is uh, given the question okay and you need to find y double dash y triple dash and so on and correspondingly you need to find last time we found uh, y not dash now you should find y n y1 dash y1 dash is equal to x1 plus y1 x1 is 1.1 y1 is from the previous uh, iteration i have uh, the value 0 0.1103833 so y1 dash value is uh, 1.21033833 similarly from y double dash is equal to we know that 1 plus y dash y1 double dash is equal to 1 plus y1 dash that is equal to 1 plus y1 dash is the value 1.21033833 so in it adds the procedure is uh, uh, similar to very similar okay so y triple dash is equal to y double dash okay i think uh, you can easily 
do up to this level even you know, uh, next you need to substitute n equal to 1 in the given formula so you'll get y2 equal to y1 plus h by 1 factorial to y1 dash and so on so y2 equal to y of x2 x2 is 1.2 so here you should know the value h and y1 y1 dash y1 double dash so everything just now we found out you should just substitute uh, in the formula and uh, using calculator you should do it carefully and you get the answer so <coughs> the second problem is also same idea okay using taylor's method compute uh, y equal to 0 0.2 and uh, y equal to 0 0.4 correct to four decimal places given that uh, dy by dx is equal to 1 minus 2xy and uh, y of 0 equal to 0. So uh, just I will tell how to find y of 0 0.2. The same procedure you need to apply y of 0 0.4. So y dash is equal to uh, dy by dx that is given. That is 1 minus 2xy. So y dash is equal to 1 minus 2xy and y of 0 equal to 0. That means uh, uh, x naught. This is x naught x0 is 0 and uh, this is y0 this is y0 y0 is 0 so h is equal to 0 0.2 because y0 is 0 and the y1 is uh, 0 0.2 and the y2 is 0 0.4 the common difference is 0 0.2 so h is equal to 0 0.2 so next uh, y dash that this is given the question so you need to find y double dash so 0 minus 2 into uv rule. So x into y dash plus y into if you differentiate x what? So y double dash is equal to minus 2 into x y dash plus y. Next y triple dash is equal to minus 2 into. So here again uv rule. So x into y double dash plus y dash into 1. If you differentiate y, you will get y dash. And then y triple dash minus 2 into again here uh, sorry I think uh, simplification y triple dash is equal to minus 2 into x y double dash <coughs> plus uh, 2 y dash next y power fourth derivative uh, similarly you should find y power fourth derivative y power fifth derivative so now correspondingly you should find y naught dash that is equal to 1 minus 2 into x naught into y naught. So x naught value is 0 and y naught value is also 0, 0, 0. So y naught dash is equal to 1. Similarly from y double dash, I am going to find uh, y naught uh, double dash. y naught double dash is equal to uh, minus 2 into x naught into y naught dash plus y naught. So minus 2 into x naught is 0, y naught dash is, is 1, and y naught is also 0. So finally, you get uh, y naught double dash is equal to 0. So from y triple dash, I'm going to find y naught triple dash. So minus 2 x naught y naught double dash plus, uh, plus uh, 2 y naught dash. Okay. Because these two are equal, and this is a simplified form. So minus 2 into x naught is 0, y naught double dash is also 0, plus 2 into y naught dash is 1. So finally, you have minus 4. So next, uh, you know, y power fourth derivative. So y naught uh, fourth derivative is minus 2 x naught y naught triple dash plus 3 into y naught double dash so so x naught is 0 y naught triple dash is uh, minus 4 plus 3 into y naught double dash is 0 so i'll get 0 finally so similarly for uh, fifth derivative and uh, the far this is a Taylor series formula the general formula if you substitute n equal to 0 you get y1 
So anyone knows uh, his uh, name? I think I think his name is very new to me. Any idea? Is he is your classmate? Please reply. No, sir. We don't know, sir. Thank you. Okay. Now, uh, so n equal to zero. If you substitute n equal to zero, you get uh, uh, y one equal to y naught plus h by one factorial into y naught dash, and so on. So substitute the values. Just now we found, okay, and uh, using C, you should find the value of y one equal to y of zero point two. Okay. Now you should take uh, x one equal to zero point two and uh, y one equal to 1.94752003 and h is equal to 0 0.2. Again, it should proceed the same idea, okay, which is similar to the previous one. You can find y2, y2 is v of 0 0.2, okay. So now, before, okay, this is a practice problem I gave to you, but uh, yeah, now I want to solve one, one problem here because. Uh, at least one problem. We will do it in the, in the class. So third problem. So now I'm choosing the third. I am expecting the answer from your side. So using Taylor series method. Using Taylor series method, find we of one point one and we of one point two correct to. Four decimal places. Correct to four decimal places are given dy by dx. equal to x into y power 1 by 3 and y of 1 equal to 1. So try this problem. So here, y dash is equal to, okay, before uh, I'm going to y dash, y of 1 equal to 1, okay, y of 1 equal to 1, uh, y of 1 equal to 1 implies uh, x naught is 1, y naught is 1. And h is also, uh, 1.1, sorry, 0 0.1, which is 0 0.1, okay. Now, what is given the question? Y dash, that is dy by dx is equal to x into y power 1 by 3. Okay, now, now find the corresponding uh, At the corresponding y not dash okay y not dash is equal to x not to y not power one by three 
that is equal to what is x naught? X naught is one. Y naught is uh, one. Y naught is one. So we get uh, one. So Y naught dash is equal to one. So next uh, we find Y double dash. <coughs> y double dash is equal to x into u v root x into one by three. Y power one by three minus one minus two by three into y dash plus uh, one into y power one by three. Now this is equal to x one by three into x one by three into x y power minus two by three. What is y dash? Y dash is uh, x into x into y power one by three plus y power one by three. So this is equal to one by three x square x into x x square y power minus two by three y power one by three so y power minus one by three. Plus uh, y power one by three. This is y double dash. So now now find the corresponding y not double dash. So what is y not double dash? Uh, one by three. By three x not uh, x not square into y not power minus one by three plus y not power one by three. So this is equal to one by three x not is uh, one. Y naught is also one. Again, Y naught is one. So one by three plus uh, one is uh, four by three. Next, you should find the uh, Y triple dash. Y triple dash. Okay. Mm -hmm. So please check it. I think you have one by three x square into Y power minus one by three. So I'm just I'm keeping x square by three as it is. So differentiate y power minus one by three, you get minus one by three into y power minus one by three minus one, that is minus four by three into y dash. Into y dash. And then if you differentiate x square, you'll get two x you get 2x by 2x by 3 uh, into y power minus 1 by 3 plus you have y power 1 by 3 if you differentiate y power 1 by 3 you have 1 by 3 y power 1 by 3 minus 1 is minus 2 by 3 into y dash so just simplify y triple dash is equal to minus x square minus x square by 9 y power minus 4 by 3 into y dash plus 2x by 3 to y power minus 1 by 3 plus 1 by 3 into y power minus 2 by 3 into y dash. Okay, now correspondingly you should find what? Correspondingly you should find, okay. Y 
Why not? Why not? Triple dash. So why not triple dash is uh, minus x not square by nine into why not power minus four by three. Why not dash plus two into x not by three into why not power minus one by three plus one by three into y not power minus two by three into y not dash. So substitute and uh, so x not is one by nine y not is one y not dash is also one. What is y not dash is one plus two into x not is one y not is one plus one by three y not is one y not dash is one minus one by nine plus two by three plus one by three so minus one by nine three by three is one so minus one plus uh, nine that is eight by nine so eight by nine now so i think up to this is enough okay so next i'm going to write the Taylor series expansion y1 equal to y not plus uh, h into y not dash plus h square by 2 factorial into y not double dash plus h cube by 3 factorial y not y not triple dash plus so substitute the formula and using calculator do it and tell the final answer so i am expecting the answer from your side so y1 equal to y of 1.1 that is uh, x1 h y naught is 1 plus h is 0 0.1 into y naught dash y naught dash is uh, not dash is one plus h square h is zero point one h square by two factorial into why not double dash why not double dash is what four by three Plus H Q zero point one and Q by three factorial is six into Y naught triple dash Y naught triple dash is eight by nine plus and so so, so do it uh, using calci and tell what is uh, one plus point one plus point one whole square by two into four by three. So please tell. Point one whole square divided by two. into 4 by 3 so please tell the value 
So I think I got uh, ah, please tell zero point. 0 0.0066. I got uh, this answer uh, 0 0.0066. So please once again check it 0 0.1 whole square by 2 into 4 by 3. Zero point zero zero two nine. Mm. Okay, first, uh, what is the zero point one whole square? Okay, uh, equal to sorry, point one whole square equal to point uh, zero one divided by two divided by two is what? Uh, five into ten to the power of uh, minus three. Yeah. So into 4, into 4 I am getting 0 0.02, 0 0.02 divided by 3, divided by 3 I got 6.6666, so only 6 into 10 to the power of minus 3. So 10 to the power of minus 3 means so you should put uh, three places. Uh, uh, should you should put uh, 0, 0 point. I think I got this answer. So anybody got this answer? Yes, sir. Correct only. Sir. Yes, sir. Uh, why you are getting? Uh, what about your model? Check it. Uh, I think. Uh, I think. Uh, Degree mode is enough uh, here and I, I ask degree mode. Please check the mode. Degree mode. Okay. 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 Now I think some of you got the same answer. So practice is uh, very essential. Okay. So you may think so we have calculator, we can do. That is okay. If you solve the problem in the calculator. Sometimes you get the error like this. But the problem is you can't cross check whether your answer is correct or not. So that is the main problem. Okay, you should be very careful. Next, 0 0.1 whole cube divided by 6 into 8 by 9. Uh, 0 0.00148. Ah, triple zero only one, one four eight. Ah. Yeah, sir. Okay, thank you. Plus and so on. So this is a Taylor series. This is the infinite series. So you should put plus dot dot dot. Okay, this is after adding this. Please check it. I will write the answer. If there is any correction, you can inform me. So one point one. 0681. Okay, I think there is no correction. Now, uh, similarly, you should, st you should start with uh, again. Start with x1, comma y1. X1 is uh, 1.1. This one is 1.1. Y1 is 1.10681 as a starting value. So starting value so x1 equal to x1 equal to 1.1 and the y1 equal to 1.10681 
so again uh now i am going to ask uh, uh from you okay because we know that already the derivatives you know already the derivative that is y dash is equal to y dash is equal to this is a given problem x into y power 1 by 3 now correspondingly it should what is uh, y1 dash using calc using calculator you should do it and tell what is y1 dash it is equal to x1 into y1 power 1 by 3 x1 is uh, 1 what oh, sorry x1 is 1.1 y1 is uh, 1.1 one zero one zero six eight one whole power one by three so please tell what is y1 dash one point one three seven uh, one point one three seven eight five okay okay next uh y double dash uh, okay i'll write directly y double dash because uh already we've Calculated y double dash that is 1 by 3 1 by 3 x square y power minus 1 by 3 plus y power 1 by 3. So y1 double dash is equal to 1 by 3. 1 by 3 x1 square x1 square y1 power minus 1 by 3 plus y1 power 1 by 3. So simplify and tell the final answer. So x1 is excuse uh, me, sir. Uh, please tell. Sir. So can't we calculate by changing the h value to 0 0.2 instead of derivating again and again? 0 0.2. Yeah, so uh, h value to 0 0.2 yeah, is so much easier. Uh, but, uh, but the procedure is you should do follow this procedure only. H is equal to 0 0.1 only. Okay, you can't directly follow. Actually, in the here, the here, you, you, how if I don't understand how you will find her directly. So let's consider. Let us consider y one big y one y one equal to uh, y of one point two. Y one equal to y of one point two. Ah, okay. Yes, sir. So uh, that h value becomes zero point two, na sir. Okay, but. Uh, but you can't do like this, okay? Yes. So, okay. So actually, this is the procedure. So as per the procedure, we we will we need to go. Okay. Suppose, uh, uh, okay. So suppose if you do like this, uh, uh, please do it in your notebook. Uh, I will check it. I, so please take a photocopy in my free time. I will check it whether it is correct. I think it is not correct. So I want to double check with you uh, whether your method is correct or not. So please, if possible, you can do it that using that method. Send to me my personal WhatsApp. I will check it. Okay. So may I know your name? Vamsi, sir. Vamsi. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Now, what is the Y1 double dash? 1.4243. Okay. okay, now similarly next next uh, y1 triple dash. So directly found find the y1 triple dash.
And you got the answer? Or you want to do dash? It takes uh, time. Zero point nine. Yeah, zero point. Okay, zero point. Nine two nine eight one. Okay, nine two nine eight one. So I got nine two nine seven eight. Okay, eight seven. So if it is very near to this value, okay, no problem. And then final value that is y2 equal to y1 plus h into y1 dash plus h square by 2 factorial. Into y1 double dash plus y3 by 3 factorial into y1 triple dash plus some so on. Okay. So, y of 1.2 is one point two two seven seven two. So please check the answer. If there is any uh, deviation from this answer, you can inform to me. Okay. So now, just I want to introduce the next uh, uh, method. The next method is the. Uh, Euler method. Next method is Euler method. So the aim of this method is again to solve the first order differential equation given the initial condition y of x naught equal to y naught. Okay. Uh, actually, here it is mentioned here in solving first order differential equation by numerical methods. Uh, actually. Uh, just we come across only one type of solution. Uh, sorry, actually there are two types of solution. There are two types of solution, but we come across only one method, that is the Taylor's method. Uh, Picard's method is also there, but it is not in your syllabus. Picard's method. So there are two types of solution. So one is a series solution. One is the series solution that is uh, by Taylor series and the Picard's method. Uh, you can get the series solution, a series of y in terms of x, which yield the value of y at a, at a particular value of uh, x by direct substitution in the series solution. Second one is the uh, values of y at uh, specified values of x. So there are two types of solutions. Okay, the the method Taylor series method and the Picard's method. Uh, okay, belongs to the first category, first category, and uh, method due to Euler, we are going to study 
ஆயிலர் ரஞ்சி குட்டா ஆடம் பேஷ்வத் அண்ட் மில்லியன் கம்ஸ் அண்டர் த செகண்ட் கேட்டகரி தட் இஸ் வேல்யூஸ் ஆஃப் ஒய் அட் ஸ்பெசிஃபைடு வேல்யூஸ் ஆஃப் எக்ஸ் த மெத்தட்ஸ் ஆஃப் செகண்ட் கேட்டகரிஸ் ஆர் கால் த ஸ்டெப் பை ஸ்டெப் மெத்தட்ஸ் because the value of y are calculated by sh- short steps ahead of equal interval equal interval h of the independent variable x okay so euler's method so a to find the numerical solution of the equation du by dx is equal to uh, f of x comma y given the initial condition given the initial condition y of x not equal to y not so in uh, euler method we approximate uh, the curve of solution by by tangent in each interval by the tangent in each interval that is by sequence of uh, short lines a sequence of short lines unless h is small unless h is small the error is uh, bound to be quite significant this sequence of lines may also deviate considerably from the curve of solution so euler's formula yn plus 1 equal to yn plus h into f of x n comma yn so this is a euler formula so yn that is a so yn plus 1 is depending upon the previous iteration value and the uh, h value and the function value at uh, in the previous iteration so where n varies from 0 1 2 3 etc so so this is the first problem okay so y dash is equal to minus y the problem is uh, dy by dx is equal to minus y and y of 0 equal to 1 e of 0 equal to 1 and uh, determine the values of y at determine the values of y at x is equal to 0.01 and uh, within bracket again 0.01 and next uh, 0.04 this means this is the starting value that is this is uh, this value is x not this value is y not so and hence uh, this is uh, x1 x1 is 0.0 sorry 0.01 and this is h value the second one is h value h is also 0.01 that means x2 is what 0.02 x3 is uh, 0.03 so this is the last value this is a starting value this is the last value this is a common difference x4 equal to 0.04 and h is equal to 0.01 okay now so correspondingly corresponding to x1 to x4 we need to find y1 y2 y3 y4 so that is a problem we have to find y1 y2 y3 y4 for this uh, i am going to use the euler's formula yn plus 1 equal to yn plus h into f of xn comma yn uh, so let us take uh, n equal to 0 substitute n equal to 0 in the formula so we we'll get y1 equal to y1 equal to uh, y of x1 y of x1 what is x1 0.01 that is equal to y0 plus h into y0 plus h into f of x not comma y not if okay that is uh, y not is uh, given the question y not is what 1 and x not is 0 so y not is 1 h is what that is also given the question 0.01 f of x not comma y not what is f of x comma y f of x comma y is minus y f of x comma y is minus y so f of x not comma y not is minus y not so 1 plus uh, 0.01 y not is what 
y not is uh, 1 so minus 1 dividing part is simplification now we got y1 similarly to substitute n equal to 1 you will get y2 y2 equal to y1 plus h into f of x1 comma y1 so y1 is just now we found y1 0.99 h is 0.01 f of x1 comma y1 is uh, from the function uh, we know that f of x comma y is minus y f of x1 comma y1 is minus y1 so simplify and get the answer and n equal to 2 will get y3 and n equal to 3 will get y4 so so the same procedure that's why i'll skip quickly okay and this is the second problem so again we will discuss uh, ILS method if possible tomorrow I, I think tomorrow at least i will solve one problem in the classroom okay uh, and uh, uh, what is this problem? This is uh, y dash is equal to x plus y. Y dash is equal to x plus y. Mm. Okay. So before that, I want to share one more information with you. Okay. Uh, just now I received the message. Uh, okay. Actually, this is about the internal pattern for all senior classes of both UG and PG. As per the as per the dean school of uh, uh, okay it's, it's a sketch from my school okay uh, the pattern is uh, best four performances out of six accounted for twenty marks accounted for twenty marks plus five marks for assignment okay so this is the uh, uh, okay, for internal marks, I think you have for 25. I think last semester, I, I think there is there is no marks for assignment. I think so. Okay, this semester, uh, best four performance out of six, so accounted for 20 marks plus five marks for assignment. I think uh, I gave only two assignments, so I think I need to give two more assignments. Okay, I will prepare the questions and then I will post as early as possible. Uh, and also prepare very well for the final exam. Okay. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, uh, usually, you know that uh, it is online online exam. The question paper is not direct. It is not direct uh, direct questions. So it should be uh, prepared very well. So we will discuss about the question uh, paper later. Okay, uh, still you have time. Okay, but uh, just I am telling you, you should you should uh, you should uh, concentrate more and uh, refer some other book, some other materials. Okay, and also I will share with you what I have. Uh, if I found anything new, I will share with you. Uh, I think the uh, time is uh, nearly 9.45. Okay, we will discuss the ILS method again tomorrow, uh, 6th hour. And if you have any doubts, you can ask to me. Vamsi, uh, if possible, you can do it by that method. Send to me. I will check it. Uh, we will discuss again tomorrow, 6th hour. Okay. If you have any doubts, you can ask to me. Otherwise, you can leave. We'll meet tomorrow.